in the collection of embroidery designs that come with the Husqvarna Viking Designer Epic are something called cutwork embroidery designs. Now it's hard to tell on screen which ones are cutwork and which ones are applique and which ones are felting designs, uh, but there is a quick way to find those. So let's say you're on an adventure and you want to try out some cutwork designs. In the select technique area, which is normally over here at uh, basic embroidery, you can come over and notice all the different techniques. If you want to learn about wing needle embroidery, twin needle embroidery, did you know you can do that with an embroidery design? There are designs in this machine specific for these different techniques. And also when you go into an area such as cutwork embroidery, there's going to be the tutorials that will come up as well. So you don't have to reach for your manual for how to do it. Now remember, Remember, this is just all the designs. Now up front, I will show you that there is some universal pictures for what cutwork designs look like. So right here where it has these little symbols, cutwork with scissors or cutwork with needle embroidery. Those are specialty needles that cut for you. That when you actually go into this area, if you find a design that has, here's one, that has that little symbol, this is one for cutwork needles. And so it actually cuts out a lot of this background areas. You just can't tell it just by looking at the picture. Now, even though this is set up for cutwork, if you just wanna embroider this without cutting, you could just follow along and just work through the design colors just with normal needles and and the thread colors you want. So let's talk about what we're working with. Uh, this is, so let's just do cut work with scissors. This is a very common one. When we pick this, you will find that it goes to designs that are in this machine that are specific for the cut work with scissors. So let's just take the most simplest design and pull it on screen. And with this, we do have a little tutorial that also pops up. Remember, you can go ahead and bring it a little higher up on yours. Oh, there's the fabric selection that you can choose from as well. Uh, make it a little bit bigger and then work yourself through the different steps, what you're needing, how each of these is going to be done step by step. I'm gonna minimize that. That will hang out right here in this little brown dome at the bottom. But I know for sure that this is made to be a cut work design. So usually it means by layer different fabrics and then you're cutting out and making it empty or exposing the layer that's below it. And this is something that we do in our Embroidery Essentials online course. Uh, this block here is our cut work block. It does have two layers of fabric that you do layer. And so when you're cutting, you're only cutting through the top layer and then that exposes that second layer of fabric below. And then the two colors of thread really make it pop. In our class of all the 15 different techniques that we do and teach, this one is usually the one our students say is one of their favorites. I, it's just, I think it just pops. They have fun doing it and cut work kind of becomes a new favorite technique. They just didn't know it when they started. So if you are interested in our Embroidery Essentials course, you can visit embroidery-essentials.com and get signed up with it. By the way, we do use a Viking Epic as the machine uh, during this whole entire course, so you'll actually be able to follow along really easy because my screens will match your screens. So let's go back to the other cut work options. So what about the one that said cut work with needles? So this is actually where you have and need to purchase actual cut work needles. They are designed in here. We'll just pick a design. I know you won't technically be able to see it until you actually stitch it but what happens is is there the needles have chisels on them and so it'll tell you to put there's four needles total each needle has a chisel aiming at a different angle so when you put it in as a needle there's a chisel and it points one direction so then it cuts at all the vertical areas and then it switches over and says put cut work needle two on and then that one will cut this way and then it will cut where it is before you know it you've got fabric that has been cut into the shapes that you're doing. It's actually really fun and easy to do. You just follow along with the directions. And like I said, the machine actually knows that this is a cut work design with cut work needles. So it'll tell you with a pop-up screen which needle to put in. And they're color coded, so it even comes up like, you need cut work needle, and it'll show the color like yellow or red. And then you'll know which one you're putting in so you don't kind of goof it along the way. So cut work needles are something that you can pick up at your local Husqvarna Viking store and try out some cut work designs.